The Perry Gate at the northern end of the Lapuru Cemetery now stands out in brilliant white with a commanding new black gate. It was the work of the visiting sailors of the USS Underwood, the ship an Oliver Perry class frigate. And today, with the visit of an Oliver Perry class ship, the crew volunteered to come out and do some additional restoration work. They touched up the paint, they helped to uh, paint the wall of Lappy Rose Cemetery, which, as you know, is in rough shape after all these years. And that's what they've been out here since 7 o'clock in the morning doing. Writer Louis Homer, who has been leading the awareness of the historical value of the Perry Gate, says Oliver Perry, who the gate is named after, promoted peace in the Caribbean and his death off the coast of Trinidad saw him being buried here in La Perouse Cemetery for seven years. This is the second time in six months that we have been historizing a man called Oliver Hazard Perry. We did it uh, three months ago where the gate was uh, installed and so on. And when I was told by the embassy through the uh, Public Affairs Division that the Underwood, which is also a product of uh, uh, um, Perry, is coming to Trinidad, the question they ask is, what can we do? And I told them, Roland and myself, we told them, what you can do is to complete the painting on the, on the outside of the Tragrit Road. For the sailors, the work was part of their way of paying tribute to one of their own. Yes, we're actually looking forward to coming and helping beautify the gate of Oliver Hazard Perry. Yes, we are, all, we are all proud and honored to be here. Next year, there will be an extensive exhibition on the life and times of Oliver Perry. Reporting for CNC3 News, I'm Charlene Ramdani.